Greetings, friends, and welcome to today's Family Altar Audio Devotional. Our scripture reading comes to us today from the book of Isaiah, chapter 35, verse 8, and the quote is by William Marion Branham from the message entitled, Expectation. This message was preached on February 7th, 1961. We hope that you are blessed today as you listen. And then highways shall be there, and a way, and it shall be called the way of holiness. The unclean shall not pass over it, but it shall be for those. The wayfaring man, though fools, shall not err therein. Now there's no two Holy Ghosts, there's only one Holy Ghost. That's right. Only one Holy Ghost. And that same Holy Ghost that led Simeon to believe that he would not die until he seen the Lord Christ that same Holy Spirit's telling me something's going to happen. I just believe it. And it's telling you the same thing. Let's be expecting it. Let's get ready for it. Make ready. Like taking a trip, get everything packed up. No, this, ta- this kind of a trip, you unpack everything. Got too much packed up now. <laughs> There's a trouble. I we have to unload. So this trip, you unload. You have to get right in the middle of the road. One of the dear brothers, brother... Um, I was going to say Deweese, I believe. No, not, that's Oral Roberts. Um, oh, he's the state superintendent of the Assemblies of God of Indiana. I forget what his name is now. And he, uh, Brother Weed, Roy Weed. I guess you all know him. Brother Weed, one day, my cousin, uh, Brother Vibbert, has one of the biggest Pentecostal Assembly of God churches in the East, in Evansville, Indiana. He has whole city blocks. This, they're talking to church meeting. So they had a, I believe it's called the 500 room. Uh, across the street, there's a garage, so Brother Vibbert just bought it out, and his brother running competition in Indianapolis, who can have uh, how many thousand Sunday school. So he had a man's school over there that he just taught in on Sunday morning, 500 in the class. So I was supposed to speak that morning at the man's class. I sat behind Brother Roy, and Brother Roy said, you know, I heard a man say, that was me, that uh, uh, the middle of the road is the place. said, the middle of the road, I believe that. God said in Isaiah 35, there shall be a highway. Many of you dear Nazarenes used to sing, a highway of holiness. No, there shall be a highway and, and is a conjunction that ties your sentences together, and a way, and it shall be called the way of holiness. Not the highway of holiness, the way. Correct roads built so the water washes trash one side or the other. So you either be real cold and starchy or a fanatic. On the, but the way is right in the middle of the road, right towards Calvary, right up the road. So Brother Weed stood up and said, a man, that isn't good driving ethics. He said, if a man drove in the middle of the road, he'd get killed. So that's not good driving ethics. He didn't know I sat behind you. I touched him on the shoulder. I said, that's it, brother. You're just so earthbound. You're, I said, this road, you don't come back. It's just one-way traffic going that way. <laughs> <laughs> He is, he's a sweet brother, just as fine as could ever be thought. Oh, God, don't, don't make him better than Roy Weed. <laughs> it's just a cute story. He said, now you drive in the middle of the road, you get hit. I said, brother, we, we won't get hit. We're going one straight way, just right way. We're not coming back at all. A one-way ticket. I'm glad I got it, aren't you? A one-way ticket. What the Holy Ghost reveals through his word, I believe that is truth. And we stay right with it. We trust that you have been blessed by God's word today. The devotional you just heard was derived from Brother Tim Dodd's Family Altar devotional book. If you are interested in a copy of your own, you can visit store.bibleway.org to order your own copy. If you would like to listen to more daily Family Altar audio devotionals and other spiritual message related content, we invite you to subscribe to the 10,000 Worlds podcast or visit our website at 10 kworlds.com that's the number 10 the letter k the word worlds.com thank you and god bless you